Hi guys, this is Marlena from Mid Studio and uh, today we're going to unbox this workshop dice jar. So uh, I just got it with my new order, if you saw my latest video. Uh, so now I'm just going to show you dice by dice what's inside. And the dice jar are pretty cool because uh, you get you can get the dice that uh, are uh, either no longer made or are just uh, the designs that are available but in different colors that are not in the shop. So let's just start. So uh, yeah, the first dice I picked is this the eight dragon dice. It's red and white. Uh, I think you can get this color in the shop, but it's... I don't think it's very popular, you know. Uh, the darker ones are more popular, I think. Another dice is uh, quite popular in my shop. It's the D20 Elven dice in white and black. Next one is uh, D6 which is the classic D6 from Quirkshop. So it has no ornaments, just uh, in this uh, five you have some dots, but other than that it's pretty normal. It's quite big, I would say. Uh, another one is uh, D6 uh, Japanese with kanji numbers. If you don't know how to read them, uh, you can find it, I think you can find it on the internet because now there's everything on the internet, but if you order a full set uh, of these dice from Quirkshop, you have the numbers translated on the back of the package. So Another one is the 12 tech dice in beige and black. Uh, I like this uh, these dice. They're pretty, you know. They feel really solid, like a tech dice should. <laughs> no, you know what I mean or not? <laughs> Another one is the twelve dragon in black and yellow. Next one is another D twelve. This is an elven D twelve in green and white. Next one is Cthulhu, Call of Cthulhu in black and yellow. I haven't seen this color uh, coloring in their shop, but uh, I think I got uh, the same dice with my last uh, jar, so. Another one is the 12 forest dice. This, these ones are also really, really pretty. Uh, another D12, it's also the uh, oven green and white. Uh, another D20 oven in white and black. D12 and white and black dragon dice. D6 dragon dice in red and black. Trying to catch good light because uh, this dice is pretty dark. D. Uh, 100 or percentage dice in red and black. It's an elven dice. The red ones are pretty dark. It's hard to show them. Another 
D12 uh, in green and white. It's also an 11 one. Percentage dice. It's also green and white 11 dice. Uh, another 11 dice, but this time it's uh, transparent with blue numbers. Uh, the 12 dragon one in blue and black. Uh, the eight, uh, it's the runic, uh, the, the eight and um, green and white. Percentage dice in red and white, it's also an album one. Uh, I think in my last box, uh, that uh, jar, sorry, in my last jar, I also got a lot of elven dice. Another elven die, it's uh, another one, another D20 in white and black. Okay, let's look. Oh, okay. This one is a D12, uh, which is a nook. Uh, dies a die and it's in black and yellow and this one is from the old set because uh, they got redesigned so um, this is the old design uh, I like both the old and the new design they're quite different but both are uh, equally awesome and they have all the look feel so another d6 uh, kanji japanese dice and what do we have here okay uh forest d8 this one is gray and white I usually get them in green, so it's pretty cool to have a different color. Another elephant dye, this one is a D10 in white and black. Okay, here we have D12, D12 uh, it's the steampunk old design. Uh, and the, this one is in yellow and brown, which is quite unique because they usually have the other way around. So you usually have or had, I don't know, with the new design if they also have it. But with the old design, they had uh, them in brown and yellow. So this is the other way around. And the 12 dragon in black and red. Okay, I see I got uh, a lot of D8s. So here I have four D8 Elven transparent blue dice. I also got like 10 of these in my last jar, so that's pretty weird. Okay, the 10 dragon in white and black. The 12 dragon in black and yellow. Another black and yellow uh, dragon die, but this one is the percentage dice. Mm, D6 in black and yellow, but this one is runic. Okay, another D6, uh, I don't know how it is called, I don't remember it, but it has those tiny, tiny skulls, you have to really, really look closely because uh, at first sight you don't see that these are skulls, you just see some black background with a bit of white, so if you look really, really closely I don't know if you will be able to see that on my camera, but uh, 
yeah there are uh, in the background the whole background is covered with skulls so this is pretty wicked uh, another d8 in uh, black and yellow it's an elven one okay this one is a tech d8 in beige and black Come on, come on. Okay, another uh, forest D8 die. It's this one is beige. Yeah, the the previous one was uh, the previous one was grey, uh, and this one is beige and black. And here I have the percentage die in it's transparent with blue and it's an elephant die and uh, I also got the transparent and black one. I'm sorry my boyfriend just walked into the room. Uh, okay so uh, here is a black and red dragon percentage die. Uh, here is another, I think it's uh, also Japanese. I'm sorry, I'm not really, I don't really know the symbols, so it might be different, but yeah, I think it's Japanese. Uh, it's, I'm not sure if it's a percentage die or a d10 die, because they have the same shape and I don't know these symbols, so. <laughs> but it's a black and white one. Okay, here I have a D8 in transparent and red is an elven one. Um, a D6, uh, it's yellow and black and it's steampunk. another steampunk one uh, so it's a double uh, the one I showed you before and one more of these <laughs> okay another d8 album in transparent blue Some more transparent blue elven dye, but the percentage dye. D6 dragon dye in white and black. Okay, uh, the, the D8 elven transparent dye with uh, this one is with blue and red, so the numbers are red and the um, writings, the elvish writings are in blue. Um, and I don't think you can get those in a shop, so uh, I got some of these before in my jars, so they're quite popular in the jars, but not in the shop, you cannot get them in the shop. D12 Celtic or Celtic uh, Celtic dye in uh, black and yellow. Another one, but in grey and black. Okay, this one is from a Pathfinder set, but I don't remember which one exactly, I don't remember the name, uh, but it's green with silver numbers and it has little leaves on each side. Uh, this is a transparent with red numbers, uh, classic dye. Okay, another Japanese, but uh, in white and red 
uh, D12 with dragon uh, design. It's in blue and black. Uh, D10 in black and white. It's uh, the steampunk one. Another Japanese in black and white. Uh, I don't think I got so many Japanese ones before. Uh, percentage dice in transparent and black. It's the Elven set. From the Elven set. Mm, okay, right here I have two uh, tech dice. And these are percentage die, dice, and they are in black and blue. Okay, this one is from Nook set, but it's from the new design, and it's in white and black. And this one is in yellow and black. It's a D4 or it's the steampunk one. to take them out. <laughs> okay, a D4 dragon in the red and black. Uh, another one from the, uh, that I don't remember the name, but it's the one with the skulls on it. Uh, yeah, and it's a D10. Two more Elven D20 white and black. Oh, this one is a good, uh, good one. It's uh, Call of Cthulhu. It's the green glowing in the dark. D6. Okay, here I have Dragon D20 in black and uh, green. And I probably can't see it, but uh, if you look at uh, it's a bit of transparent if you look into the light, you know, so. mm. no, it's not going to be seen in on the video because it's not really see through like you can you can't see the other side, but if you look uh, onto the light into the light you see that it's not entirely black, you know, it's like semi-transparent or something like that. What do we have here? Okay, here is a D8. Uh, it's the Nook, Nook 1, Nook dies in black and red. Uh, here is a D6, uh, it's the oven one in black and red. Percentage die, it's the dragon red and black. D4 um, Elven in green and white. Percentage die, transparent with black numbers, the Elven one. D8 dragon die uh, in white and black. Another dragon die, in, but this time in green and black. Uh, I don't think this one is very popular. I haven't ordered it before. Uh, here is a uh, D4. It's the oh sorry, D4 in yellow and black. Another D4. It's the classic one. What do we have? Okay, so a few more D20s in white and black, the Elven ones. So pretty much of those. And some more the transparent D8s in blue. Mm, 
two more percentage uh, oven dye and yeah, transparent black. Okay, I don't think I got this one before. It's a percentage dye, it's the open one, but it is with blue and red. So I only got, I think, before the eight and the four. So this is the first one. Okay, mm another percentage dye, it's this time it's just with blue, no red. Mm, one more tag percentage in black and blue. Two more dragon in black and white D12s. Mm, okay, the runic D100 in blue and on black. Another D12, the oven green and white. Dragon D6 in red and black. Okay, the uh, four dragon in red and sorry, <laughs> in blue and black. Uh, another D6 dragon in white and black. Classic D20 in white and black. D12 dragon in black and yellow. D4 dragon in black and yellow. D8 dragon in uh, yellow and black. D4 uh, alban dye in red and white d4 dragon die in green and white d8 oven die in gray and black mm, another classic d20 in white and black mm, percentage die in green and white and it is the runic one Okay, D6, uh, this one is the, um, the oven in black and red. Okay, uh, here is the nook D4 from the previous design and it is in blue and black. D8 dragon in red and white D12 dwarven in uh, yellow and black two D8 dwarven in beige and black And also one in white and black. Uh, D4 in beige and black. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> D6 runic in white and black. Call of Cthulhu in pink and black. These are really cute. And there aren't a lot of pink dyes from cork shop, so... <laughs> uh, another Japanese, but this is from the set that I usually get. Uh, so it is the white with red uh, kanji numbers and some flower pattern. Percentage uh, dragon in black and white. And percentage dragon in uh, black and red. Another dwarven D8 in gray and black. Another percentage dragon die in black and white. 
uh, the four dragon in red and black d6 uh, it's the classic one in white and black d4 dwarven uh, in grey and black oh yet another tech uh, percentage die in black and blue d4 uh, elven transparent red percentage uh, runic in red and white d12 dragon in black and red d4 runic in red and black d4 red and blue runic die uh, this one is also quite unique you cannot buy this in a shop uh, but I think I've seen these before. Uh, the four orange and black uh, Elven dye, it is also quite unique. I've had uh, this color before, but uh, I haven't seen it in a shop, you know, like in a set or separately, just in, in the jars. Uh, the 12 in blue and black it's the runic one the four in green and black the dragon die uh, another the dragon d4 this one is in black and yellow and this one is in black and red it's also dragon d4 uh, transparent classic die in with blue num uh, blue sorry red numbers uh, yeah and what do we have here okay another one with the little skulls in the background so I really wish I could show it to you but oh here. Do you see it? Can you see it? Yeah? Can you see the little skulls? It's quite quite cool. And also uh, this one is also the same with the skulls but it's in grey. So it's even harder to see <laughs> them. Okay. And Warven D4 in yellow and black. And this is percentage die in green and black and it is the runic one. Another dwarven uh, die, it's the percentage die in yellow and black. And this one is in white and black, it's also the dwarven percentage die. Um, okay, the eight dwarven in beige and black. And uh, here I have, oh my god, I forgot the name of these, but they are black and red and they have all this pretty cool design. Mm, here's another uh, it's not the runic one, it's the... is it the dwarven? No. It's the Celtic. Oh, it's the Celtic on D12 in white and black. And here's another one in black and red. Oh, I really don't remember the name of this one. It's also part of this uh, this one is the same from the same set and these d12 i don't remember th the name of this set oh my god sorry guys okay so as you can see that's pretty much uh a lot of dice mm, i don't think uh i got a full set uh yeah so uh if you want a full set 
you don't you probably wouldn't get it in the jar uh, you get a lot of different dye different dyes and a lot of uh, the same dyes but you also get some pretty unique ones so yeah so that that's it thanks for watching and sorry for all the interruptions today and see you next time bye